Brachial plexus branches are represented here by the literal brachial plexus branches. The branches include the musculocutaneous nerve, depicted by the muscle and skin nerve, and innervates all arm flexors and skin of the forearm. The axillary nerve, shown by the ax nerve, innervates the deltoid and teres minor muscles, which laterally rotates the arm. The radial nerve tire represents the radial nerve, which innervates all arm extensors and the forearm. The median nerve, median road nerve, innervates most forearm flexors and five hand muscles. Lastly, the ulnar nerve, underwear nerve, innervates 1 to 1.5 flexors in the forearm and the remaining hand muscles. So recall that the brachial plexus branches include the musculocutaneous, axillary, radial, median, and ulnar nerves. It's like a lumberjack fell a tree to build the brachial plexus. The roots are cut away from the trunk and divided into cords of wood and the leftover branches. The branches are bundled by the muscle skin nerve while the axe nerve clears a path. For the rest of the story, check out Picmonic.com and sign up for a free account. There, you can also take Picmonic's quiz. The quiz automatically sets up your daily quiz by using spaced repetition algorithms based on the questions you've missed or struggled with to make sure you study what you need when you need to. And while you're at it, check out the rest of our brachial plexus picmonics. We've got everything you'll need to remember. Everything from chords, divisions, roots, trunks, and much, much more. So you can lock down on everything you need to know forever. Play. Quiz and spaced repetition. Efficient, effective, and research proven to increase exam scores.